All right, hello everybody and welcome to another Elevator Parts video. Today we're going to be working on something a little bit bigger than our typical call station. Today we'll be working on this very large innovation car panel. Now this car panel was given to me by Mike from Automatic Elevator. So huge thank you to Mike for this amazing panel. So let's go ahead and take a look at it in closer detail. So just by taking a look at the visual wear on the panel, we can see over here we've got some sort of just gluey stuff which should come off very easily. Got some just various spots on here, some more glue stuff. As for the indicator, there's where the indicator would be. Here we have the emergency lights. Here we've got various key switches, fire service, light and fan, call cancel, and the fire light. Here we have our floor buttons, three, two, and one, open, close, alarm, emergency stop switch. And then here we have firefighters operation plate and a phone door with a missing handle. So this is one of the uh, swing panels. So if we just kind of fold it up here like this, it opens right up. And well, we're not gonna be working on it like this, so we'll be taking this out of the box. But looking on the side, we can see all the wires. You can see there's a bell right there. And just in general, a big mess. <laughs> so what we're gonna do, take the whole panel out of the box and take all the wires off and then we're gonna work on cleaning up the panel. It'll be a pretty big job, but I think we can do it. All right guys, so for the most part, we've, re we've removed most of the wires here, taken off the big clump, Got a bunch of little red ones here that have come off the panel. And now we're ready to really start working with it. So we have the alarm button here, which has a bulb in it. Obviously our three floor buttons, which have bulbs. The door open and close don't, so they won't be lit up. Got our bell here, probably gonna take the bell off as we really don't need it on the back. And it's 120 volt, we like to run everything on low voltage. Uh, this here is a fire service buzzer. And we're gonna take it off, see what we can do with it. If we can wire it up to low voltage, we'll hook it up to the alarm. If not, we'll just leave it off. Uh, up here, we're gonna hook up the fire service key switch to the fire light to make it light up. Unfortunately, we don't have an emergency light or a um, indicator, so we'll be leaving that blank. But just wanna get the essential parts wired up and working. So let's, uh, let's get started. So that's the back side of the panel done. Now we need to work on the front. Now we're not gonna take all the buttons off. I'm just gonna clean around the parts that need to be cleaned up. So let's go ahead and do that. All right, so I've cleaned up the panel. You see all the buttons work. So I think it's now time to put it back on the box, which is down there. All right, so this panel is pretty much finished for now. Taking a look at it, it's a lot shinier and a lot more cleaned up. You can press, press in the floor buttons. Those light up, the alarm lights up red. And if we take our fire service key switch, you can see the fire light turns on. And it's a little, uh, there we go. The fire service light turns on. And then finally I added this little metal handle. It's not an actual handle, but it, it'll work to open the phone door. So for now, that'll be it. I would eventually like to add an emergency light and a little floor indicator. But for now, this is what we're gonna do with this thing. And it's pretty awesome. All right guys, it is actually a complete separate day right now than when I was filming the original video. And I was just looking at this panel and look what I found hidden at the bottom. I found the original phone handle. So, we're gonna take this stupid thing off and put this on. Let's do it. All right, so there's the 
there's the little phone door, which looks a lot better. And the last thing I'm gonna do is just add a couple screws onto the uh, corners here just to keep the panel closed up. All right, now the panel is completely finished. So we have our floor buttons here. Three, two, one. The alarm button lights up red. Currently with no sound, but maybe one day it'll do something. And we take our fire service key switch, turn it to on, you can see the fire hat light turns on. And then down here, we have our little phone box, which for now we're just keeping the extra parts in there. So, that is it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this little video. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.